What's up YouTube, Josh coming at you and today for CRT Saturday Matinee, we're gonna go with a classic, one of my favorite games on one of my favorite systems, DuckTales. Stay tuned. So welcome back you guys. So like I said, for CRT Saturday Matinee, today we are gonna go with Capcom's famous DuckTales, the first one, cause I'm not rich enough like Uncle Scrooge to get the second one, not yet anyway. <laughs> Um, before we jump into DuckTales gameplay, though, we got a shout out back here on the screen and we got a beer. As you will see from this beer that we're going to show you right now, there's a reason that we picked DuckTales. The beer for today we have is the Bankrupt Duck. This one comes to us from my favorite, as I've said a billion, billion times on these videos, my favorite brewery, Brewery Fire, Tawny Town, Maryland. This one right here is... 16 ounces of McDuckling in a kiddie pool full of pennies. <laughs> this is a 60 shilling ale. It comes in at 3.7% ABV. Let's have a, uh, a sniff and a taste. It smells pretty good. It smells like a standard kind of like a brown ale or lager or something of that nature. Not bad. It's got, um, it's got kind of a, like a hint in a way of, um, like a coffee, but it's not like coffee or chocolatey like a stout is. It's not creamy like that either. It's more it's more along the lines of like a standard ale or like a lager, as I said, but it's not too bad. It's pretty tasty. Really cool can art too. For the shout out we have on the screen back here, I had to show some love to my friend back here behind us. And the reason that I had to show some love to him is because he's shown me plenty of love over the past year. And he's also, uh, I made a little trade with him as well. So I figured I would throw that in here on CRT Saturday matinee. Let me grab the box because I forgot to grab it. All right, so I made a trade with him. The guy on the screen back here, you guys probably already recognize him. I know most of you guys out there are probably already subbed to him, but if you are not, you better get over and subscribe to him because Dad Racer is the man. He does some really cool videos. Um, he, do he does a lot of the stuff like I do, but he does a lot of stuff that I think is pretty neat on its own. He does, he's got a knack for making the shorts. Um, I haven't figured that knack out. I haven't, haven't studied enough and put enough work into it to do it as well as he does, but he makes some excellent shorts. And he also does a lot of stuff where he, he opens stuff or plays games or does different things with his daughter on the channel. Retro Gamer at heart right there. Go over and check him out if you guys haven't already. Please go over, drop him a sub. We made a little trade. I don't know if he's planning on making a video of um, the trade that the stuff that I sent him, but he reached out and uh, asked me if I had a certain Sega Master System game that he knew I was collected for him. It was one that he didn't want anymore that he wanted to shuffle on. And um, he asked if I was interested and I said, sure, I'm interested. Uh, love to add some stuff to the collection, to the Sega collection. It's kind of small still, but it's growing. And um, I let him look my stuff over and I sent him a couple games and this is what he sent me here. So we got this box right here. Just got it in the mail yesterday when I'm recording this. So Let's see what we have in here. The trade I sent him was a couple of uh, NES games, and he was sending me this beautiful boxed copy of Operation Wolf for the Master System. This one is a complete copy. It has the manual. Really nice shaped cartridge as well. Um, this puppy was an extra that it, he had thrown, and he asked if anybody was interested. I mean, it's a it's an overlay for an NES controller, and it. it's like a Kirby overlay. So. I was like, nobody nobody else uh, claimed it. And I was like, sure, I'll take it if uh, if you're willing to send it my way. Looks like he also sent an extra game in here as well. And some nice packaging. We got Peter Jackson's King Kong, the official game of the movie. And it is a, looks like a really super clean, really clean, complete copy. I've actually never played this one and I don't have it in my Xbox uh, collection. So I really appreciate the extra, man. Thanks for the trade. Always fun trading with you guys in the collective. Let's get into this DuckTales gameplay. You guys can see how bad I am. I haven't played it in so long. <laughs>
So welcome back, you guys. So I know all of you have seen DuckTales in action before. If you haven't, you've been living under a rock. It's definitely one of, I think it's one of the better games, one of the best games, honestly, on the Nintendo. At least I have a lot of nostalgia and a lot of love for it. I'm not practiced enough at it. I need to play it a little bit more, honestly. It's so, it had so much fun with it. I didn't want to pop it back out to uh, do the outro because I want to keep playing it. But that's all we got for this CRT Saturday matinee. Please Take a trip over to Dad Racer's channel. Drop him a sub if you are not already subbed to him. If you get a chance, check out some of your tasty local brews. Like, uh, you know, this one was really cool. Really pretty good one. Till next time, everyone. Take care of yourself. Happy Saturday. Cheers.